now. Problems for some folks on the American River. They've tried to sneak alcohol onto the water during the Rafting Gone Wild event. As KCRA 3 Sharkini Sham shows us, the social media driven event has be, again become a massive party on the river. The liquid poured out of this water bottle wasn't water. A county parks ranger said it was vodka. And then. Oh, come on. After all this, do you think I'm going to trust you guys? He had to check this group's other bottles. He let them go rafting. They didn't want to talk about the vodka. No, we're, not, we're just not going to comment. Thanks. Rafting gone wild. The annual party on the American River slowed down last year and ramped up again this year. Relissa Chismar drove 200 miles just to be part of it and had an open bottle taken away. Well, for my first time, it kind of sucks. I wanted to drink on the river, but I guess I've been having a lot of problems, so it's understandable. Sammy Diaz says he organized this year's rafting gone wild, which rangers say drew more than 200 rafts to the river today. We're supposed to depart at 12, and there are still many people coming with beer. <laughs> with, with beer. Yeah. Is that a good thing? Uh, for the most part, for some people, it's a bad thing, but... You know, if you're not know to control your alcohol, you should be good. Rangers say they wrote more than a dozen citations. Alcohol that makes it past this point is often caught at other river access points downstream. Four hours now when they get to the, the pullout spot, nobody's smiling anymore. They're all hot, they're tired, they're dehydrated, and then their tempers flare. And then that's usually where we start having the physical fights down there when people drink too much. In Sacramento County, Sharif Nashams, KCRA 3 News. And park rangers say some people had to be pulled out of the water this afternoon because they were in distress.